Huskies seem like really smart dogs, but how easy are they to train? If they can pull a sled then they must be pretty intelligent, right? I did a little research and the answer may surprise you. So, are Huskies easy to train? Huskies are incredibly energetic, willful, and at times, downright stubborn. They are intelligent and ambitious, always seeking to be the top dog. Huskies are more likely to listen to a strong owner, someone they are willing to recognize as the lead dog. Just because it can be difficult to train a husky, doesn't mean it is impossible. With dedicated training, you will be training your dog into a champion in no time at all. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique guide is in the description below. Why aren't huskies easy to train? In order to train your husky, you need to understand why he acts the way he does. Huskies are naturally energetic and curious, yelling at a husky for its natural behavior will only cause hurt feelings and will slow down your training. Dog sleds have been around for thousands of years. Anthropologists speculate that as long as humanity has been around, there has been some form of dog sledding. The Siberian husky was bred by the hardy Chukchi people of northeastern Asia. The Chukchi valued the dog for its loving nature, but most of all for its incredible resilience and endurance out on the ice. The Chukchi bred the Siberian Husky to be swift ice runners with endless stores of energy. The Chukchi bred the Husky from the original sled dog, the Eskimo dog. The Eskimo dog or Kimik is a powerhouse of strength and endurance. It is the forefather of the Husky. Over the years, the husky has lost much of the weight and bulkiness of the kimik and is much slimmer than its parent breed. Huskies work best as pack animals and follow the lead dog in a sled team. The lead dog is strong and resolute, he needs the power and energy necessary to manage a team of up to 22 dogs. If the lead dog shows any weakness, he may be challenged for his position. You will have to be the lead dog if you want your husky to take commands from you. Hesitation will be met with insubordination, therefore strong leadership skills are crucial for training this astute animal. Huskies are also competitive and energetic. Dog sledding is still a popular sport in some of the colder regions of the world, and the Siberian Husky is prized as the ideal sledding dog. While an endless fountain of energy may be crucial out on the unforgiving ice, it may be less desirable if you are keeping a husky in your backyard. Finding a way for your husky to burn off the energy he carries around is one of the true challenges as a husky owner. Though huskies are stubborn and mischievous, at the end of the day they are noble, loving, and loyal. Huskies feel most at home when loved by a family and will make a great addition to yours, whether big or small. Training a husky. Now that you have a better understanding as to why your husky may behave the way he does, we can dissect just how you should go about training your husky. Remember that huskies are prideful and stubborn. Training these dogs won't be something that you can accomplish in a day. Becoming the Alpha Dog Loyalty to the alpha male is critical to the success of a dog sled team. If a subordinate dog rebels and the alpha isn't strong enough to keep order, the entire team could fall apart. Huskies seem to have a nose for smelling weak leadership and are more than happy to take over if they feel they are being guided poorly. In order for you to properly train your husky, you will need to assume the role of the alpha male, otherwise your husky will take the position and walk all over you. Becoming a leader is simple enough in theory but it isn't always easy in practice. Here is what you need to do to establish yourself as the leader. Curtail negative behavior. Huskies love to run around, bark at strangers, dig holes in the backyard, and jump up onto people. Normal dog behavior but behavior that you will have to fix if you want to be respected as the leader. Correct your husky with a firm, no, anytime he does anything wrong. Don't allow for any exceptions. Stop violent behavior. It isn't uncommon for a husky to bite, posture, or engage in other violent behavior, especially as a puppy, in order to establish himself at the top of the social pecking order. Do not let your dog continue negative behaviors. Not addressing these issues when they first appear will lead to increased violence and aggression as your dog matures. Don't treat your dog as an equal. 
Huskies follow leaders, not peers. Enter the door before your husky. Make your dog got out of your way and not vice versa. Do anything that shows dominance and authority. Remember that you can be a strong leader without being a jerk. Be confident. Above all, be confident and sure of yourself. If you act confident even if you have no idea what you are doing your husky is bound to believe you and you may even to believe it too. Practice your top dog attitude and you will find that it becomes more and more natural. Leash training. Leash training your dog is an important part of socializing your dog. A puppy that never goes outside may be unfamiliar with new people and other animals, and thus aggressive towards them when they mature. From a young age, take your husky out on his leash every day. Use these walks as opportunities to teach your dog the commands we discussed in the previous section. While walking, have your puppy interact with other people and animals. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.